Hello and welcome to another Constructed Daily Event video series here on mtgmadness.com. This time I am going to play the black-white pack-red midrange deck that I wrote about, uh, wrote about last time. Um, let's take a look at the deck real quick before we jump into the daily event. The list is mostly the same as in the article. The main deck is exactly the same. And I changed a few things in the sideboard. Um, for example, I'm playing a second Graph Digger's Cage since I couldn't get a Linvala online and it's really, really expensive. And I didn't have the ticks right now to buy them, uh, to buy it, especially just for the video. Um, with pack prices being as low as they are right now. And I cut the Zealous Persecution. And I think one more card for to this figure. This figure is kind of a makeshift lightning bolt for the deck. It's really nice at killing early creatures such as Dark Confident, Birds, Noble Hierarchs. All those kinds of um, turn 1 and turn 2 creatures that might cause trouble and you that you really don't want to pass to exile. And some of them you can't Dark Blast as well. For example, Goblin Guide out of Burn. And at some point it's better to play this figure over Dark Blast. So having a 2-2 two -two split if you sideboard into 4 1 mana removal seems good to me. This figure kills a bunch of random creatures that Dark Blast doesn't. Like Kiki Jiki, Kasali Pride Mage, Return to Ooze, stuff like that. Or maybe a Muta Vault, a Flip Delver, and so on. It's also a better combo trick. And two Dark Blasts is enough. You never want to draw two. So the Basic rule is if you don't want to draw two of a card, you play two or three copies max. Okay. Um, yeah, I mean, I think I talked about most of the things in the video and uh, the article already. One Vault of the Archangel to make all those small, poor fighting creatures into better fighters. Also, has nice synergy with the first strike from Splicer. Keep in mind, Splicer also gives first strike to Mutavolt, which is pretty handy sometimes, especially with Molt, but also on defense. Like if you have two Mutavolts and a Splicer in play, it comes really hard for your opponent to attack into it. Um, Angel mostly synergizes with Splicer and has some synergy with an empty Scudder to steal their draw step. Tech just to deal with Manlands mostly. And maybe sometimes screw them. They are too greedy with colors. Um, yeah, Packrod is kind of our, our Tamagoy replacement. Deck might want a 7th discard spell just so it has more um, actual turn 1 plays and more interaction. Since we like Lightning Bolt, we want a couple of more cards to interact with our opponent early. Um, yeah, I think that covers most of it. The Drawn and Sorrows are nice, um, mainly against Affinity, because they uh, deal with an unpumped Edge Champion even, and they're also nice against Empty the Warrants out of Storm, and can come, come in handy against random de decks that might pop up, but they are mostly for Affinity and Empty the Warrants. Since the deck has trouble otherwise um, dealing with Edge Champion, it could be reasonable to um, try and replace them with the Nations, since most of the cards in the deck already die to Drown and so on anyway. So far, only the Splicer token, bigger pack rats, Restoration Angel, and the Better Skull token survive a Drown and so on. So, in a lot of cases, and your board dies to it anyway, so you might as well just consider running Damnations. The original list had one Damnation. Um, and it also has to be seen how needed 
drawn is against affinity, but it probably will be. Usually affinity is one of the weaker matchups for those types of black um, midrange, a uh, black based midrange decks. Although Lingering Souls is really good against affinity too, so there might be a way around running Drawn in Sorrow. Okay, yeah, the arena is just a one off against other controlling or slower mid range decks like black green based rock decks or blue white red, where you just want to um, grind them out. Um, yeah, I think that should cover everything so far. Nothing too special here. Let's hop into the event. See you in round one. Bye.